All right, guys, welcome back to the fort. And today, yes. we're gonna finally go through the clover lo loops. That's right, clover is 1600, is... 1700, 1800, and 1900. It no. is the first time we're back to the clover loop since the before the pandemic started. Right, and they're only opening it at certain times. That's right, for the weekends we heard, and then they close it back down for during the week. Which is today, they're gonna to be closing it, so it's our chance to go through them. Yeah. Hi! Hi. Oh! Hey. How are you? So? Here we are. So as we mentioned, this is the first time that you get a peak we're gonna go through each of them. Should we start at 16? We're gonna start at 16. Let's start at 1600. And like we said, this is the first time that we have been able to video or even enter the clover leaf since before the pandemic. So it is closed, like we said. We were told at the front desk that they have been opening only for busy weekends like Labor Day and weekends that are pretty much really booked. Today is Sunday. September 13th and it's dead only because they have upgraded us because they said this loop after these few people check out is closed again so you will see a few people in the 16 17 18 and 19 while we are videoing but it will be closed until they need to reopen it because of capacity we were upgraded to the 1300 loop though which, thank you, Disney. Yep. Thank you, Disney, for the upgrade. It was very nice. We do miss this area, though. This yeah. area is kind of like where we stay at, right in the Clover area. Uh, we have noticed that they definitely been through here already, clearing off sites. Oh, yeah, definitely. Because they had a ton of pine needles on them before. But right now, there's nobody in the 1600 loop. It's completely empty. So let's head over to 1700 after this. Yeah, I, I did see a couple people in the 17. There might be a couple people over there, but it's nice to be driving through here after so long of being closed. Yeah. And I know the last time we were here over the weekend, it wasn't open. That's right. So they kind of like pick and choose when they want to open it. At least they're maintaining it and they're keeping it clean just in case. That's right. And this one straight across is the 1700. Hickory Hollow. Oh, it's a rare yeah, occasion sight. to see this, this a rare empty. Sight. I see one RV that's left. So far, one. One RV left in here. like one in this entire loop. 1700. <laughs> one. One RV. They got all of this to themselves. And then there were none in the 1600. 
now we'll have to check out the 18 and 1900. Heading over to the 1800. Oh, I see a couple there. Hi. There's a few over here on this one. So weird to see the fort so happy. It is. But we heard that on the weekend it gets very busy. Carol, which is a cast member at the front check-in, which is a super, super nice cast member, was chatting with us and said that Labor Day was pretty packed in here, which I can imagine there would be. Wow, that's a big boy. The cyclone. A lot of big fifth wheels back here. Heck yeah. Oh, another cyclone. Two cyclones. So there were a few in here. So there's a total of six. Six in the 1800. No, five in 18 and one in the 17. Oh, okay. So there's a total of six so far. Six people. We're going to go over to 19. Let's see if anybody's in the 19 at all. Might not be anybody. 1900 blue. Coming up. anybody don't look at like anybody no these are the ones I like back here 1915 That 1916, 1918. I like all of these sites. This would be the perfect 19... time to do every single site. Yeah. Nobody on them. We should. Maybe we'll do uh, just individual loop videos. Well, we can while well, there's nobody in them. We could go and take our time and go nice and slow on each, uh, each loop. Actually, it is a perfect time to do it. And it's not raining, not hot. All right, and here is the 2100, the fifth one out of the five 
full hookup loops, we figure we would give you guys a quick shot of how busy this loop is, the 2100. And this, once again, is full hookup. Looks pretty busy. Pretty full. This is the one full hookup that has remained open. There's two sites, it's empty. Yep, there's one and then one right across was it. The one right across from it was empty. It looks like another empty spot over here. But then again, today is Sunday. So a lot of people checked out this morning. The locals, I'm assuming, There's mostly. More. Yep, so it's not as packed as we've seen it. But it had to be pretty darn busy for them to open the clover. There's another couple empty ones here on the right and an empty one on the left. So although it is busy, it is definitely not as busy as we have seen it on a Friday and Saturday. So that's going to do it for this video as far as coming through, checking out the clover. It was pretty awesome. Yeah, and for those of you who do not know, those were the... 16, 17, 18, and 1900, four out of the five full, full hookup hook loops. That's right. And, and the only other one is the 2100, which has right. remained open during all of this uh, craziness. Yeah, and I, I kind of missed driving back here. It was, uh... It's a nice blast from the past. Yes, and it's so empty. It I is. wouldn't mind being over here at all right now. Yeah. But, like I said, they're going to close it by the time these six people are gone. It's going to be shut down it. again. So Until who knows. They didn't specify if it was only weekends, but they said on busy weekends. The people up front don't even know. When they right. decide to open it, they open it. So, that's, so don't uh, count on it. Until things get back to normal, guys, that's going to be it for the 16, 17, 18, 1900 loop. That's right. And we hope you guys enjoyed the video so until next time guys we hope to see you here oh yeah right here at, at the, the fort, fort smiling and they're free take care guys <laughs>